This is a Facebook page that I recently put together for Carruthers Enterprises in order to show you what your business page could look like. What we would collect from you are two pictures. A major picture that would be the cover photo, uh, probably of your place of business or some products that you have or potentially um, some work that you've done, the result of the work, and a smaller photo that we would take of you or um, the owners of the business or maybe a company logo, something that would identify your business to your customers and your potential customers. Besides putting on these two pictures, we'll put on the description of your business. And there'll be a, a lot more we can put on than just here. Definitely put on your address, phone number, contact emails, and much more about your business. We have a place where we can collect photos, photos of products, photos of happy customers, photos of new anything that a uh, new project you're working on. Uh, people can see who has identified on Facebook that they like you, like your business, like posts that you've put out here to your business page on Facebook. And there are room to add a number of other categories of things. This is called the timeline where we go down here and here are pictures of friends who have said that they like your business and you want to collect people commenting on Facebook that they like your business. Here is where we can add status messages and I'll show you status messages in just a minute but you just type in here and then post them or we can add photos and videos, events, milestones, questions for your company, whatever. Here are the photos that we've loaded out here. And for Carruthers Enterprises, we've loaded a picture of our retirementtime.com website, a picture of condoapartmentservices.com, a website we're currently working on, a picture from Google Earth related to an early website that we built and our largest customer of our golf handicapping system, uh, a picture of their championship qualifiers. Here are places for when people respond to things you have posted here's Mike Riley and great idea Craig and he posts it on here not only does it show up for other customers of yours to see but this shows up on Mike Riley's Facebook page too that he has commented about your business here is an example where we have highlighted this because we've got it going across the entire page here and this is a comment that we put out about our retirementtime.com is a blog looking for guest authors or an editors of some of our categories. So if you were looking to hire people or you were looking to bring on a new um, project or whatever, you might put an announcement out here and make it go across your entire page. Otherwise, the rest of your timeline down here is, is in in order of when you've put out here. Um, here's where we're identifying that our marketing has been paying off and we've got new leagues signing up for our golf stuff. Here we put a milestone out here uh, of something that was accomplished. Here we put a question, how much money was, um, how many people won over $100 in the 2012 golf league and then we put out three options, and as people vote on these options, Facebook fills them in and even identifies who's voted for this option. And this shows up here. Steve Kuhn voted for this option, and this will show up on his Facebook page that he's interacted with your business and responded to this questionnaire. Uh, other statuses we put out at other times, and here are these things with flag tones, flags on them, are milestones that we put out there. The main thing I want to get across to you is what's important are several things. One is when people like something, like, say that they like your business or like something that you've posted out there, not only does it show up on your business page where 
They say they've liked you here. Wes, Wes must like this. But this will show up on Wes's Facebook page, and it will say that he liked Carruthers Enterprise. He liked this, and more people will find out about your company by reading people's Facebook posts that they like your business. So you get that viral effect is what it's called of marketing. Wes, by commenting that he likes something here, is marketing for my company. And you can have that happen to you too. The other thing that's very important is your business, the way that your business page is accessed on Facebook, the address for this will be facebook.com forward slash your business name. You do not have to buy an internet name for your business. You do not have to pay for annual web hosting services for someone to host your Facebook page. Facebook is doing that for you. So you're saving hundreds of dollars a year by not buying a name and not buying web hosting services. For that, for less money than that within one year's time, would be our charge for building this Facebook business page for you. And if you're interested, contact us. And uh, we can also talk about I can maintain it and keep it up to date for you or we'll build it for you. It's there and you keep it up to date yourself. So lots of options, but definitely you want to get this viral effect of people marketing your business for you and get up and running with that for less money than what it would take to have uh, your own website and your business out there. You can post anything about your company and these statuses. You can post photos. The main concept is other people like you and they transmit to their friends the fact that they like your business.